Now this may look familiar guys, but do not fear, this is not your uh, Thursday upload. I'm actually getting the Q&A up whilst this is rendering, so I'll be recording that for you guys. But um, that's quite cleverly titled, this is the Summer Bulking episode 4.5. This is a physique uh, comparison from February, um, and now back in June. So basically what I really want to touch on here is uh, improvements and things that I had to bring up and how I've gone about doing them and how I've actually got lagging parts now that I'm going to be tackling and doing that as well. Uh, a few things I just want to put into context with the physique comparison is that don't forget I got ill during this so I went from I'm 156 pound morning weight in February this video here. Um, I also got ill I went down to 152 pound. And just to top it all off, this was a uh, university exam period, and in case you don't follow me on Twitter, I've passed my first year of university, so I'm over the moon with that. Um, I didn't just pass, I passed with flying colours, but it was first year, so it wasn't really that difficult. So this is the physique comparison. This is February, coming to a close right now. And so like I said, just bear in mind this was exam period, uh, university, and I fell ill. 156 down to 152 pound, and now I'm back up to 161 pound morning weight. That was what I weighed this morning when I recorded this video. And so this is 161 pound morning weight. I understand I might actually be looking leaner, oddly enough. Um, bearing in mind that this is for my progress sake. This isn't a look at me, I'm sexy kind of video. This is, um, so there's no like altercation with brightness or contrast and there's no, you know, kind of trickery. I do admit like I have taken it into uh, advantage, no. I've taken it into consideration that I am closer to the camera slightly in this video but I've got some back comparisons at the end that will highlight that. So here you can see something that I really wanted to focus on was my arms. Um, I brought them up an inch, um, mostly due to my triceps and how I've gone about that was just again I had that arm day, that helped a lot but also at the moment I've actually just been really hammering arms. I've been supersetting triceps quite a lot with every exercise so I always keep a overhead plate ready to do overhead extensions after I've done every set of push downs. So I do supersets for triceps and biceps I've really focused on progressive overload with the bicep curl. Just a movement that I can really focus on and track progress and push forward with that. So it um, was a bit awkward today filming uh, in the rather intimidating looking gym. And uh, thankfully some of them actually, a lot of them in this gym actually compete. So they understood what I was doing and it wasn't too embarrassing. But uh, it wasn't definitely the most comfortable of things. And of course you may be wondering why I'm not showing legs in this video. Um, again I just don't want to drop my shorts in the gym. Legs are something that are lagging, I'm going to say that. But they, are, they have had progress and I'm not too worried about them. Um, so as you know this is a fitness model so excuse the... Uh, bodybuilding poses is just to track progress but back I think I've developed a lot of thickness um, especially in my lats the lower lats specifically um, a lot wider so my back has made significant gains I think areas that I need to improve on um, I still need to get my arms bigger and I think I need to work on my chest and my delts and my legs and how I'm going about that guys I'm, I've introduced a 5x5 five five split for bench press for overhead press and for squats. So I've introduced a 5x5, five five, something that's gonna make me really emphasize and focus on those movements, track the progressive overload. It's the highlight or the centerpiece of now my leg and shoulders workout because I start off with 5x5 five five overhead press and 5x5 five five for squat. And as well on my push, and uh, which is my chest and tricep day, I am introduced to 5x5 five five bench press. So you'll be f seeing those um, throughout the summer bulking episodes if you're seeing my workouts wondering what I'm doing. I'm now doing a 5x5 five five for bench press to try and bring up the chest, 5x5 five five overhead press to bring up the delts, and 5x5 uh, five five for squats to help bring up my legs. So that's the comparison guys, but as always, um, critique me down below. Uh, try and be as nice as possible, or constructive as possible, but um, yeah things that I need to work on, things that you've noticed, and I look forward to getting the question and answer up for you after this. So, I'll see you in that. Bye guys.